Welcome back. You know, maybe one of the biggest disappointments for the class of 2020 right now is the inability to enjoy the end of their senior year. My niece is dealing with this right now. I know a lot of kids are, but it's not mm -hmm. stopping a group of moms from honoring that class while also giving back to their community. Good news with 13 reporter Shannon Litton has this story. We decided we needed to do something to celebrate the children while keeping them safe and encouraging them to stay home. They say a picture is worth a thousand words. This picture you're looking at, a picture of letters making words. So what's that worth? Well, if you're talking money, it was made possible for $20. But if you're talking intentions and lending a helping hand, you simply can't put a price on it. It started as something simple. Lee Pittman Robinette and some other parents at Huntington High School wanted to find a way to recognize the class of 2020. We need to lift our seniors, but we need to give back and we need to show the seniors what we're doing. So she enlisted the help of Lynn Atkins, owner of Original Yard Carts right here in Ashland, Kentucky. Atkins donated those yard signs to Lee, but Lee had another idea. She wanted to take the opportunity to not just recognize seniors, but to help small businesses. The rest is history. I'm thankful to say that we've celebrated over 70 of the Huntington High School class of 2020 and we've also donated back over $1,800 to the Huntington local small business community. A lesson she hopes seniors take with them on their next chapter in life so they remember to help others always but even more in troubling times. They are, are representing a moment in time where their character is going to shine through. They are going to have memories of this, that some of them not positive, um, but some of them are, are going to form who they are later in life. In Huntington, I'm Shannon Litton, 13 News, working for you. The signs are placed in yards for two days, then moved to the next house. Now, while this project started as a way to honor Huntington High School seniors, it has spread to other school districts as well, including Spring Valley, Cabell Midland, and Fairland in Ohio. Find out how you can pitch in by clicking on Shannon's story. That's on our website at WOWKTV.com or on our 13 News app. Well, one of the organizations that many in the Kanawha Valley are turning to in these difficult times is the Mountain Mission. The organization offers both financial and food assistance and at a time when so many are hard pressed because of the pandemic, Mountain Mission needs a little, little help as well. So as part of our Good News with 13 program, we are teaming up with a group to raise some money and to help with a virtual food drive. And it's easy to get involved. Just go to our homepage, WOWKTV.com and click on the link. And if you have a positive story that you would like us to share during these tough times, we want to hear from you. Share them by sending us an email to news at WOWKTV.com. No.